My name is Kathleen Dinoan. I am a nurse at uh, UMBNJ UBHC in Piscataway, New Jersey, and I'm also the um, one of the vice presidents of HP 589. I represent the nurses outside of New York. Um, <clears throat> what I have to say about UMD, UMDNJ is there is respect within the healthcare community for employees of UMD, UMDNJ. Doctors, nurses that graduated from its halls are revered for their expertise. UMDNJ is known throughout the country for its exceptional reputation as a leader in research and medical care, its cutting edge treatment, and in Newark for the trauma one services it provides. Where will all this go? Who will others look to as the leader in healthcare? Who will be paving in the way in New Jersey for the advocation of better care, funding for the indigent, and those without a voice? Because right now, in this time, it is UMDNJ, and more specifically, fine employees of UMDNJ that have built through their hard work and dedication the fine institution that you are dis <coughs> deciding to chop up and dismember. The, empl the employees who care for the patients, the researchers who have made it their life mission to expand science in the name of UMDNJ, what will they be considered and heard? We are, we are the voice of the OMDNJ. We are the backbone of this great medical giant. And we are the voice of the people that we serve and treat. Who, at the end of the day, are the ones that are going to take the biggest hit from this reorganization. And they don't have a voice at all. Now, I have a couple questions for you guys. I don't. They're quick. Well, I guess probably the biggest one is the nurses and the staff down in Brunswick and Viscataway want to know when you're coming down to meet with us. Want to know when they're coming to meet with us in New Brunswick? Yeah, we're here. Okay, thank you.